In this video, I'm going to show you how we can create a little program in Excel that will calculate all the factors of a number. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is download the program factor.bas to my desktop. So I've opened Blackboard here and I'm going to right click on factor BAS and then click save link as I'm going to make sure to save it to my desktop as factor BAS and click save okay now the program shows up on my desktop now I'm going to open Excel and I can do that by typing Excel in the search box or you may have an icon in your taskbar for it so I click to open Excel and this is maybe a little different version of Excel from what you have now but it's similar enough first thing we have to do is open the developer tab if you look across the top you won't see any tabs that say developer click file options and then click customize ribbon and when you do that you get a bunch of boxes over here and one of them is called developer check that box click OK and now you're gonna see that you have a developer tab in your Excel click that tab and it opens a whole bunch of options we're gonna use the visual basic option so click that and it opens a new window yours may be slightly different it will probably look different but it will behave the same okay find the file tab and click import file now on your desktop look for vi uh, factor dot bas and there's mine click that and click open and on my Excel it doesn't do anything but if you go over under modules click the plus sign you'll see module 1 and if you double click it you'll see the function that we're running we're calling the function FN and it takes a number and the type of that number is called long that means it's a long integer it can be a big number okay and it goes through all of these calculations and it finally puts out a list of all the factors so how do we use this function well I'm gonna go into Excel from the visual basic window there's an Excel box and that takes me back to my Excel thing now in a1 I want you to type the number um, one two three four okay that's the number that we're gonna find the factors of now in C1 click the box and in the function window type equal sign capital FN parenthesis a1 close parenthesis now when you hit enter it's going to calculate the factors of a1 let's see if it works oh my goodness look at that one two six one seven and one two three four so remember that for any number the the factors are one and the number itself and then here we have a couple of other numbers that uh, are also factors now is 617 prime we don't know so I'm gonna type it down here 617 and over here in the box in C I'm gonna say equal sign FN now this is a 2 so I'm gonna put parenthesis a 2 and hit enter and sure enough it's prime because it only has factors of 1 and 617 now what I want you to do is type another couple of numbers get their factors and when you're done click the snipping tool down in your taskbar and click a new snip 
draw a box that includes your row and column designators, copy it, go back into Word, bring Word up, and after the hit and enter and hit Control V, and there's a picture of your Excel spreadsheet. Okay, so once you've done that, just bring down your Word file and you're all done.